Hello. I was out walking with a, a friend recently with our dogs and uh, we got to talking and he had a near catastrophe. His dog had got access to his seed potatoes and decided to play with them. Now fortunately he chose to play with one, it must have found a favourite. Um, but it knocked all the chits off uh, that seed potato. And as you can imagine, if it decided to play with all of them and knocked all the chits off all the seed potatoes, I wouldn't have liked to burn in that dog's skin. I'm just joking. His animal lover like me, dog would have been fine. But you can imagine, can't you? If that dog had decided to play with all those seed potatoes, there wouldn't have been a seed potato with a chit left on it. Um, and that got me to thinking, and, and it lines up with uh, an inquiry I've had recently on my channel um, about seed potatoes and about cheats and about what you can do and what you can't do. Uh, and, and the question I had was, um, can you remove cheats from seed potatoes uh, and what effect will that have? Will, will new cheats sprout? If your chits are too long, can you take them off and, and grow smaller chits? And to be honest, I didn't know the answer. So, there's an experiment coming on. Homegrown veg loves its experiments. Okay, we'll only use the one seed potato. This is Winston. I'm fairly sure you'll be able to see that, although as you know, I'm on the wrong side of the camera. But there are three chits. One, two, Three, okay, three cheats, one, two, three. That's just a small hole in the potato. Now I can't see any cheats anywhere else on that potato. And there doesn't even look to be any more eyes that will produce a cheat. So that looks to be it. So what we're going to do is, we're going to mark up where these cheats are, then we're going to deliberately knock them off. Okay, we'll set this potato to one side and we'll see if those chits regrow. Now they may grow in the same place or it may decide that, it, that there's an eye somewhere that I can't see uh, and it, may, it might throw up new chits. I have no idea what it'll do and the only way we're going to find out is if we conduct this experiment. Okay, so I've got this marker and I'm going to mark where these chits are. Okay, so if we just do that. Okay, that's one chit marked. And we'll do this. That's those two chits marked. And let's put a number two up here because there were two cheats and one down here because there was one cheat. Okay. How's that looking? One cheat, two cheats, both marked. Right. That cheat's gone. And so have those two. Okay. Let me just make sure there's nothing none of it left. That's it. So, this potato has no chits on it now. We'll set it aside and we'll see what happens. Okay, this is homegrown veg, signing out. <laughs>